my car the other day. Yesterday, actually. I get in my car. And look at this. Look at this. I don't know how this happened. I don't know how they get there. Now I got to get a windshield. I'm going to have to get the windshield replaced because um, I tried to see if I could get it repaired. But because it's more than six inches long and it's on the driver's side, like in the path of my view, they won't re um, repair it. It has to be replaced. So that sucks. Let me get in the house. Put the little baby back here. It's not having it. I told y'all when the car start, stopped moving, she started going crazy. I have been trying to... Well, I ain't really been trying, but I've been wanting to learn how to coupon. And so, um, a few days ago, I decided I need to really get serious about this because we are like a family of five now and stuff ain't cheap, you know what I'm saying? So, and I see people, and I see people um, doing their hauls and stuff and it's like, they be getting the stuff for so cheap and it's like, I need to get in on it. I ain't no reason why I can't learn how to do this. Like this can save me money and put money in my pocket. So last night, uh, the baby woke up about two o'clock and I stayed up till six in the morning watching YouTube, watching hauls, watching breakdowns and stuff and trying to get this thing together. Now I found out that Dollar General does a five off 25 every Saturday. So I went ahead and downloaded that app and I um, saved all the coupons and stuff that I wanted. And so my goal was to try to make a list so that I can go in and, you know, do my first little couponing trip. So I did. And I'm going to tell y'all what the plan was. I'm going to tell y'all what actually happened. Because what actually happened was not the plan. So I got these six pack of Bounty Essential Paper Tiles. They were on sale for $4.95. And the 12 double roll of Charmin tissue was also on sale for $4.95. The game planes were on sale for $3.95. This gain here is, is a 40 ounce. It was on sale for $3.95. And the Tide Simply was on sale for $2.95. Then I got a four bar of zest and a 12 ounce of dial is just a buffer item this was my original plan i was supposed to get two of the dove single bar of soap for two dollars and i had a two lot a two dollar off of two coupons so that would have made that free but they did not have any of those i was supposed to get the game which i got and I had a $2 coupon for it. I had a $1 coupon for the Tide. The game flings, $2 off that, $1 off the tissue and the bounty. And um, the dial, the three dial soaps at the end, I was supposed to get three dial soaps, but I ended up getting just one and some zest. And I was supposed to get a 16 ounce of body wash, a 12 ounce of body wash, and a dial complete which was a three bar and they were supposed to have the dollar peel off coupons on them and the 75 cent one now if all of this would have gone correctly i was going to spend thirty dollars well the total would have been thirty dollars and 75 cent with the five dollar off 25 coupon and then they had where you buy, you spend eight dollars, you save three dollars on DAO products that would took three dollars off, and then nine dollars off the digital coupons, and two dollars seventy five cent off the peel off coupons, which means I would have spent eleven dollars out of pocket. I would have saved nineteen seventy five, which means I will spent about a dollar and twenty two cent per item. So I had my little list ready. I knew exactly what I was looking for. But y'all, they like I said, it didn't go as planned because they did not have the single bar of Dove soap, and the peel-off coupons were not 
on those products. And I also noticed that the prices were different on the Dow products as well. Like, um, the one that was supposed, the three bar of Dow soap that was supposed to be $1.75 was actually like $2.75. And then the Dove body wash, the 12 ounce, let me see, I mean the Dow, the 12, let me see, the, the 12 ounce of Dow body wash was supposed to be $3 with the dollar peel off coupon. It was two seventy five, which is that's good, but it didn't have the dollar peel off on any of the Dow products. And then the sixteen ounce of Dow body wash, it was supposed to be three twenty five. I think it was like four dollars or something, whatever it was. But none of the Dow products had the dollar peel off, which kind of threw me off because I'm new to this. This is my first trip and it's like oh my gosh like this is not what i wrote down so what do i do now and then i'm sitting up here trying to recalculate and baby was crying and i was like oh my god so this is what actually happened so what i showed you all in the beginning is what i actually end up getting i did have a two dollar coupon for the game one dollar off the tide a dollar off the charm and the bounty and 50 cent off of the game fling which if you remember on the other one it was supposed to be two dollars off the game fling you guys and then i ended up getting a zest for 175 and a dial for 275 because i was just throwed off and i needed something to make me to make my total equal 25 dollars so i could get the five for 25 off so that total ended up being 25 dollars and 25 cent <clears throat> with the five dollars off 25 makes it 2025 and my coupons total five dollars and fifty cent which means i paid fourteen dollars and seventy five cent out of pocket i saved ten dollars and fifty cent which makes it about two dollars and eleven cent per item now i end up spending three dollars and seventy five cent more than what i had planned but I guess that's not bad, you know, for my first try. And $2.11 per item. I mean, I can deal with that. I ain't never got a six roll of paper towels and 12 roll of tissue for $2.11. So, you know. Mm -mm. But I went home. When I got home, I had to sit down and look at my receipt and look at my plan and what actually happened and just write everything out to see where I went wrong. And one thing that I noticed that could have saved me two dollars which means I would have ended up just being a dollar and seventy five cent over budget is this now these gain flings were three dollars and ninety five cent I had a coupon I had a digital coupon in the Dollar General app for two dollars off of gain now, originally I was either going to get the game fireworks which were which are those little um little beads scent those little scent booster things i was originally going to get those but i thought that the coupon said the fireworks or the flames so i ended up getting the flames turns out when i got home and looked over everything the coupon was only for well the coupon didn't include the flames so i was supposed to use my two dollar coupon but it didn't take because the two dollar coupon that i had was not for the flings it was for the fireworks but i did find this 50 cent off coupon in the paper in the mail and i ended up using this so that's how i got 50 cent off of the flings so you guys i know better next time that i really need to read the coupon that was my mistake but i'm thinking i might take it back because even because they both are the same price the flings and the fireworks are the same price and i did get 50 cent off of these which the lady gave me the coupon back but it also includes the fireworks and so i'm thinking that if i take these back and just swap it out for the fireworks and then use my coupon you know 
they get my two dollars back hopefully <laughs> so yeah i know better next time that i need to really read and what i and what i'm also going to do is i'm going to go to the store the day before because the next I did get another coupon, five dollars off twenty-five, and this one is for July seventh, which is this, which is next Saturday, cause today is Saturday. And um, what I'm actually gonna do is go to the store the day before to see what's on sale, what they have, what they don't have. So when I go in to do my shopping, I know exactly, you know, this won't happen again. I think I did pretty good for the first try, and it actually wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. But um, I'm definitely looking forward to trying again next Saturday with Dollar General. And I look forward to trying my hand in like another store. But I kind of want to do this a few times to kind of get the hang of it. And then I start branching out to other stores. And then maybe I can start branching out to groceries and stuff. Because we can really use groceries. But it's also good to not have to spend as much on household products.